All right, so we're back. Obviously, I ran into some technical difficulties trying to figure out which pipe was left and which one was right. Uh, I did have it correct in the first place. The problem was the way these hangers are shaped on the top didn't quite seem like I had it at the right angle, and actually, I just had to twist it a little bit more. The the angle of the output seemed to be going right in and against the differential which is never a, a good thing that you want because you always want to ensure that you have adequate space in between where you're going and what you're working with. So one of the things that we're working with right now, as you can see I have a good about half inch gap for, for what I'm going to be working with here. And then once I get my other hanger in and get that more anchored in, hopefully that'll maintain that gap a little bit stronger. And then we got to make sure that our gaps inside here and that nothing's rubbing because the last thing you want is any permanent damage to your differential or to a very expensive exhaust system that you got, which this time I actually spent the, the money instead of getting the aluminized steel, I actually got the uh, stainless the 409 stainless so hopefully that'll hold on a little bit better uh, for you remember when I told you about putting your hanger on you can see that's what we're looking at here then that hooks out word there then all I have to do is just throw it up on the hook there and now I can anchor it down so put it inside of here I line my screw. anchored right where it's supposed to be and the last part is going to be doing our exhaust and we're doing the tailpipes the very tips and tightening it down so check back for our next segment